two babes hey guys and welcome back to another hello stranger it's been a minute since we last kicked let me catch my breath i just ran from the back to the front of the store so i have officially brought back a lip gloss wholesale i'm not sure for how long but i just want to say run 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 the reason i'm bringing it back now it's so funny because i literally watched the video today of why i made the decision to get rid of it and how things were going in our life like a year ago and it's just so crazy to know how it's going now it's literally sitting on the floor in our apartment and now we bought a house we have a 3,200 square foot office space. So now we have the space because that was another big um, reason why I didn't. We have the space now. And I'm bringing actually lip gloss back to our Ashanti collection business. I haven't even actually brought lip gloss back to our own body butter business. And I don't even know how long. And I'm like, you know what? Since I'm bringing lip gloss back for us, why not? Why not bring it back for y'all? Like I've been watching all my old YouTube videos. Like I am not to say I'm not like iconic, but it's like, it's so crazy. Like... From where i was then to now like it's <laughs> y'all it is crazy but anyway i'm bringing back the lip glosses that made me originally six figures y'all these lip glosses y'all loved these lip glosses our customers love these lip glosses and they're back is all i gotta say they're back and today you're gonna watch me make some lip gloss wholesale orders i have two orders right now so i'm gonna make these lip gloss wholesale orders but what's nice is i'm just going to like just stack up on lip gloss if you guys want to buy it it's there and it'll be just ready for you whereas last time i didn't have that option a year ago and i was just so busy with body butters and so many other things but now i have the space my mind's clear i have the time i have the energy and effort to put back towards lip gloss wholesale and just lip gloss for our own business so today you're gonna watch me pack my first lip gloss wholesale order in literally two years I'm so excited. So anyway, guys, I'm gonna change my gloves because I, of course, I'm touching all over myself. So I'm gonna change my glove, wash my hands, get back to it. Um, and yeah, let's, let's go. This is Toffee. She is our lightest, smoothest brown. She's just a light brown nude and she's just perfect for any freaking look. Literally guys, getting back into the swing of making lip glosses has been so much fun. It's been literally such a freaking long time. This is Truffle and she is just the ultimate nude, guys. I'm saying the ultimate light chocolatey brown nude. She's bomb too. <laughs> And then guys, lastly, in our brownie butter collection is Coco Kisses. She is the epitome of melted chocolate on the lips, guys. She is a deep, creamy brown and just looks like melted, like look, she literally looks like melted chocolate on the lips. And she smells like it too. Alright guys, this is Baby Girl and she is our subtle, soft, baby pink. Oh, 
Alright guys, next up is Bougie Bitch. The perfect way to describe her is a Barbie pink gloss. You know how the Barbie logo is a light, soft pink? That's exactly what Bougie Bitch is. A Barbie gloss. And then we have Fantasy, which is dark, deep, hot pink. First wholesale orders in two years. Look at that. Look at that pigment. Look at that color. Look at that chocolatey brown. The dark, plump pinks. Literally, we created the perfect nudes two years ago, and we're creating it again now. If you want to make a couple hundred dollars extra a month, if not more, because literally, I'm going to include the math breakdown for each container. This is a four-ounce size and an eight-ounce, um, and then they're measured later. But look at that. I'm going to include the breakdown of how to make a profit from these guys. So, yeah. orders for lip gloss wholesale are officially out all right guys so to be frank i'm not really like a perfumey type of person but that wasn't until that wasn't until i smelled these scents that i have in front of me so without further ado guys let's get into them i'm just not really like in touch with like my feminine side like you know what i mean like i just i always dress like oversized t-shirts biker shorts and sweatpants like you're not you're not gonna catch me in a dress you're just not gonna catch me with like super feminine energy but let me just oh look at them in the light with the nails oh but look he i've been wearing this one freaking non-stop like no lie guys like you can already kind of tell like i've been wearing that non-freaking stop okay so this one is called ambery vanilla and this one smells so freaking Also, it just smells so sweet, so light, and so floral. And Dossier, what they do is they emulate these perfumes off of actual like designer one, designer scents. It's YSL Black Opium, so that's what this is inspired by. And it has notes of mandarin, pear, pink, licorice, vanilla, coffee, jasmine. It just smells so sweet and so floral, and it's not like over overwhelming. So a lot of perfumes, I think that's the issue I have with perfumes. They're just really overbearing, and it just smells like you're like a 40-year-old woman. That sounded really really weird and a little rude but honestly i just i don't like the overbearing sense if that makes any sense not that there's anything wrong if you that's you that's you i personally don't like overbearing sense i think it's too strong and that's not me but yeah 
and it's like like I can smell you 200 feet away and it's like uh -uh, mm -mm, I, don't, I don't gotta smell that good like ugh. but this one just smells so sweet and so floral and so decadent and just just a nice sweet smell I and mean, just smelling good is just bomb so I already make products that make you smell good so don't just add an extra little layer on top of it and it lasts so long. It just smells so sweet and floral. I've been literally wearing that nonstop. Like, you guys can, no lie, see how much I've already used this perfume. So, yes. And then I have Floral Marshmallow. Now, Floral Marshmallow is given, I'm going to a gala. I'm going to a ball. I'm going to a dance. Something formal. This is what Floral Marshmallow is giving me. It's a little stronger. And this one has notes of marshmallow, neroli, bergamot, amber, vanilla, musk. And it is inspired by the By Killian perfume. But yeah, guys, if you just want to upgrade your smell overall and to smell really good without smelling overwhelming or just smell your age, just smell light, floral, and sweet, this is your company. And I'm going to link everything down below. Forgive this. I was frying yesterday for, for um look at this i had this on my counter yesterday but um yeah guys so check them out i'm gonna link everything down below 